We all know that time makes everything obsolete. So as Scott Brick says, the ability to upgrade is important. Luckily, it's easy to upgrade with Nutanix. So let's take a look. Hello, my name is Srikala Shetty and I work as a Systems Reliability Engineer here at Nutanix. In this quick video, I'd like to introduce you to how Nutanix enables you to perform upgrades on AOS without causing any downtime to your clusters or any disruption to your VMs. Nutanix recommends that you upgrade all the nodes in the cluster to the same version of AOS and provides a mechanism to do so that is on a rolling basis, upgrading one node at a time. The process to perform an EOS upgrade is simple and can be done using Prism Central and Prism Element. I'm going to describe how to do this using Prism Central. First, within the LCM in Prism Central, and secondly, using the Actions option in Prism Central. Before we jump too far into the upgrade, let's describe what LCM does. LCM, that is the Lifecycle Manager, performs two functions, taking inventory of the cluster and performing updates on the cluster. Before performing an update, LCM runs a set of pre-checks in order to verify the state of the cluster. If any of these checks fail, LCM stops the update. LCM is built both into Prism Central and Prism Element and hence no additional preparation is required. First, click the Entities menu and in the drop-down menu, click Administration and then click LCM. Click on Perform Inventory to discover what upgrades are available. Performing an inventory can automatically update the LCM framework to a newer version. Nutanix recommends that you upgrade and run NCC, then upgrade Prism Central first before performing the step. The inventory will let you know which software updates are available for your clusters and will even ensure that any dependencies are selected prior to performing an upgrade. Select the desired versions and click Upgrade. Without using LCM, log on to Prism Central. From Prism Central, click the Entities menu. From the drop-down menu, select Hardware and then click Clusters. In the Clusters window, check the box next to your cluster. Click the Actions drop-down menu and click Upgrade Software. In the Upgrade Software dialog window, choose the version that you want to upgrade to from the drop-down menu. You can select whether you want to apply the upgrades at the same time or whether you want to do it one at a time in the order you specify. When you are certain, Click the Upgrade button. You can monitor the progress in the Tasks menu in Prism. You can check the version in the User drop-down menu by clicking About Nutanix. Congratulations! You have now upgraded AOS on all the nodes in the cluster. Make sure that you're aware of the differences between the LTS and the STS versions of AOS and that you've checked the guest OS section of the compatibility matrix to ensure that the guest VM operating systems are supported on the newer version of AOS that you'll be upgrading to. Be aware that LCM upgrades are not reversible and there is no downgrade option. So it is always worth the effort to check beforehand to see if everything that you have are supported on the newer version of AOS that you'll be upgrading to. Don't forget to like and subscribe to stay up to date on all of our Nutanix University videos. Thanks for watching.